Fun Dance Mom here today. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, those who are new, welcome. I would like to do a packing video, a pack it up video today for my brand new Toki Doki Jujube Hobo B in the C Punk print. I am very excited to be doing a collaboration type video today so with a uh, busy with five and I will put her link above for her she's going to be doing this a video also on her hobo B packed up for two girls um, similar to what I'm doing today I'm just going to pack it up for my one and a half year old and all this here woo, is going to go in there the medium be organized and the little pouch next to it they're just ones that I would use either one of so I will show you how both of those go into the hobo bee today so let's get started so the hobo bee is one of jujubee's smallest structured bags it can be used as a nappy bag it does come with a change pad that comes into this um, in this back pocket here it's a very light change pad that can be folded up very neatly and compactly it is a messenger style or over the shoulder bag. Uh, this is a seatbelt strap that I have attached to the bag because I find it easier on these swivel clips to be able to use this bag. The original strap is this one here. It does come with a padded shoulder pad. I have attached swivel clips to it. Normally it will, would attach directly to the bag, but I found it kind of gets twisted a lot, so I like to attach these swivel clips. So I will probably go between this strap and this strap here, because I do like to have to wear this a little bit shorter strap than across my body. I find it more comfortable. This is in the gorgeous new Jujubee and Toki Doki collaboration print called Sea Punk. Now I was a little bit um, curious about this one. I didn't know if I'd like it, but in real life it is so Pretty. I'm so happy I broke down and got the Hobo B. I think it's perfect in this print and I love my print placement real quick. I love mozzarella uh, right there and I love Sandy. Those are my probably my two favorite. And then on the back here, is it close up, same kind of panel, but I also have Donatella sticking out from here. So, and then the sides are this exact same, which I found kind of funny. <laughs> They're the exact same print placement, maybe. So in the Hobo B, there's a pocket on either side that it, that's insulated. I don't use those for bottles. I actually put other things in those bottle pockets. For instance, in this one here, I'm going to put a lip gloss and a lipstick. And I usually have a, a packet of mints, but I just ran out because my kids eat them all on me. <laughs> on the other side, I'm going to put my keys because I like to be able to access my keys. These are also perfect pocket sizes for mobile phones, but I actually do use the cell phone pocket here. So that being said, I'm going to put my mobile phone, my iPhone 7 Plus, into this pocket right here. Fits perfect. This is felt lined. It's a very roomy pocket. Now. In the front pocket here, it zips open. Now this is the best part of this print. It is a vibrant, fluorescent pink stripes. It is really pink. And it's got the pink mesh, which I think is so cool. I didn't think I'd like this, but honestly, I really do like it. It's so cool. Okay, so in the Hobo B, you've got a zipper at the back and then two uh, pockets here and a key leash. I don't put my keys on the key leash, obviously. I just kind of tuck that in. So what I'm gonna put in this pocket here I'm going to put some tissues in this little elastic pocket there, some antibacterial wipes into this pocket here, like that, pop that in there. And the only other thing I'm going to put in there is my wallet, which is, this is a Toki Doki King's Court custom wallet, a little bit smaller than a Be Rich. And I did have my Be Rich in here, but it was a little bit long, so I just switched to this one because I do like to switch my wallets out. So that goes in there really easily. That closes up. Now there's a nice long zipper here. It does have does come across from the opening, so it does, can open up wide. There's the inside of the Hobo B in case you're not familiar. There's a zipper at the back here, long zipper, two mesh pockets, a mesh pocket here, and then a little zipper here. And again, that beautiful pink, vibrant pink striped lining. I really, really like it. Okay, so let's start in the back zip pocket. What I like to put in the back there is a change of clothes. And I only take a pair of pants because my daughter is one and a half. She doesn't really have blowouts anymore. This is basically going to be packed up if we're going out for the morning. 
I'm usually home by midday, so I don't need to take too much. And we're usually at the mall, so if she does have a really bad break, um, blowout or whatever, I can go and just buy her a $2 shirt or something. But I do take pants, and these actually work really, really well in this back zip pocket. And as you can see, in case you're wondering in the Hobo B, this is a solid pink in the back here when you open up the pocket. And you just lay this flat like this and zip that close and it works and it just hides it away. Some people like to put nappies back there. I like to put the change of clothes. Now we'll start with this pocket here. What I'm gonna put in there is I'm gonna use some Be Organized pieces today. This is in Space Place. I don't, I do have a Sea Punk Be Organized coming. It just hasn't even shipped yet. So I don't know when I'm gonna get that one, but I do have some other prints. So in this small Be Organized, I like to use it for toys. My daughter's at that age where she's fiddly, she likes to play with things. So I did have these in a small set piece, but I found they actually worked better in a small be organized. So just some little cars, Thomas the train from her brother. I think this is like 10 years old. This is such an old train, <laughs> old train. And I love these little Sonny angels. I'm kind of, a, I'm a little bit weak when it comes to these things. I like to buy those. Kind of like the um, Toki Doki Myrmikonos and things like that. So these work really well in a small be organized and I put that in that little pocket right there. Next to that I'm going to use another small be organized and this is in, um, is it Super Toki? Sorry, Super Toki. And this has my snacks in it. So it has a crunch bar, a um, muesli bar, and this just has some dry fruits and nuts in there. And I put that in this pocket right here. And then inside that same pocket I like to put a little uh, fork that just gets stuck in there now I am aware I might poke myself with that but I just have to be careful <laughs> this pocket here now in the front here I put my small set piece this is in Rosie Posey I just think this looks really pretty with that actually this just goes really nicely and in here this is all my mommy needs first aid so I have some hand sanitizer some hand cream lens wipes band-aids I did end up putting these alcohol wipes because we can't get the little neosporin sprays like you can in the US. I just can't find anything like that here. That's the closest thing I can find for like cuts and abrasions and things. I have some floss on a stick, some Vongella down the bottom, some Nurofen and some nail clippers which are really handy. A uh, coin purse with a beanie bib inside rolled up so that goes next to that. I could put it back here with this but I find it's kind of, if you kind of put them next to each other that way it's not sticking out as much. Now there's a, there's a pocket right here and in here I like to put my Toki Doki coin purse in Roma print. And this has a little round brush, clips and hair ties and bobby pins in there. So that fits perfect in that little zip pocket. What I do like to put in the center is my nappy needs. Now this is a little pouch that I got from Typo, which is a um, stationary kind of shop here in Australia. And I actually got this, it was only $15, and I thought it'd be kind of nifty as a nappy pouch, and it has worked out quite well. Here's the light change pad. I'll just show you this real quick, because this is so cool. Look at the, it's just, <laughs> and then this is the print on the other side. I really like these change pads because they do come in handy. You can fold them up so small. Just fold in half. See, it's really small. And then next, I've got two size five they're kind of like toddler size. People have asked me what size 5 means because in Australia a lot of the nappies aren't sized. They're just done by weight. So this I think was 15 to 25 kilo nappies. Now on the end here I do have a custom made little uh, tag in Donatella's Sweet Shop. And there's another zipper here that has some wipes in there. Just That's probably a half a, size, half a packet of wipes. And then another little zipper and I've just got some disposable baggies in there. So I can put that one in the center here, like this. And I kind of shove it to the side. The Y pouch in floral. This is kind of a bit, I guess, not. it's not very full. I like to have a decent amount in there. I can put that next to it like that. This is a Funtainer. And I think this is like a, kind of like a nine ounce a little bit more than nine ounces. I usually take one drink bottle for all of us, even if I have my four-year-old with me, um, unless somebody's sick, and then I'll take a separate one. But most of the time they're not, thankfully. So it's just in the corner like that, really easy. I'll put in my daughter's gummy, gummy glove. She loves her gummy glove, just in like that. And the other day I actually popped in two mandarins on top and it's still closed. So close it like this. <laughs> And perfecto. One thing I wanted to show you is I can and I usually do use a medium 
be organized in the middle here. I've actually packed my super turkey up just to show you. And in this one, I just have my nappies down two size five again nappies. And I have a, this is a Booty Pop flip wipe case. Another light change pad from another Hobo B I've got. Coin purse with baggies in it. So that's what I take a lot of the time in all different size bags. And this is really good because it squishes down. And I can put that in there like that. And that actually gives me even more room on the side there where the bottle is. You can actually get this in here too. So there you go. You just kind of have to move things around. This fork's getting in the way. I put that over that side. Okay, so there's my Hobo B packed up for my one and a half year old and myself out for the morning, which we normally do every day. I'm always going grocery shopping. If you have four or more kids, you'll understand you're always going grocery shopping. Please check out Busy With Five packing video as well. I've got her link down the bottom in the description. If you liked this video today, please give me a thumbs up if you did. If you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing so you can see other content that I am uploading. So if you guys have a great afternoon and I'll talk to you next time. Bye-bye.